if you're pushing 30 and you don't have a skincare routine, I don't know what you're doing. I really don't. <laughs> Just to, you know, put myself in a routine again. I'm gonna go work out, do what I used to do already. The same thing, nothing really. I've just been slacking with my routine. I haven't been doing so well. So, this is just me trying to give myself structure again with my workouts. That's what I mean, because my workouts have been bad. I'm not gonna lie. I haven't been, I've been, I haven't been working out as much as I'm supposed to, so. smelling good it makes it you know nice to work out just something smaller. let's go can you guys believe this i've been here for like a good 10 minutes my tv is spoiled our tv is officially broken because it's on but the light are all the way down it's like dim and i don't know why Can you imagine the one day, but the one day I decide I want to put myself back in a routine, my TV breaks down. Let's see. Oh, you can't even see. Like the writing is there. I can see that it says the name of the TV, but it's like very low light. Even you guys couldn't see. So I'm going to work out with my phone and my husband and I will figure this out because it's been going on for three days and we need a new TV. Can you imagine as an adult the things that you don't even plan for that you have to be doing? I tried to use my projector. We'll just use that for right now because which business do we have buying TV right now? God. Anyway, let me just work out. Okay, you might not see it because... I'm gonna use my phone to go onto YouTube, so yeah. Make me wanna stay in on the You're the reason. It's 7.51. It's time for me to go to work, okay? So I'm gonna go <clears throat> next breakfast for myself and my husband. Um, so I'm gonna go to work and I will see you guys a little later in the day, okay? <laughs> I am not sad for sure. It's going to be quiet today. <laughs> it is going to be quiet today, but I am going to definitely miss her because she brings life to the house. So mm -hmm. I know for a fact that I'm going to miss her. But you guys, it's daycare run. We're almost there. His mom is here. Auntie Jax is taking us today. So I look crusty as hell, but it's okay. I'm sure every mom looks like this in the mornings. <laughs> Um, but yeah, we're almost there. I don't know how she's gonna take it. Um, but the first day we went, she was fine. So I hope today that we're not gonna be there with her, she would actually still be fine. It's coming up here. Guys, I'm home. Drop off is done. <laughs> the feeling is crazy. Like she's not at home. She's gone to daycare. She's literally in daycare. So I don't know how it's going to go, but it's the first day I have to go to work, literally right now. Um, but for what's worth, she didn't cry. Um, she didn't act anyway, so hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed. But I'll check in with her a little later in the day. They have an app that you can actually watch them on, which is really cool. So I'm going to, you know, go on that app, literally helicopter mom. <laughs> helicoptering <laughs> but i'm gonna go to work it's thursday so i will see you guys when we're done with the day we'll figure out what we're doing with our home alone kid free life for the day okay hi 
So I just closed from work. It is currently 2.45. I have just closed from work. And let me just say that my very first day of being kid free with the house, I don't know how to act. Like, I don't know. She's not around. She's in school. I've been looking at updates on the app. I don't know if I told you guys, but the daycare that she goes to, they have an app that you can actually look and see not a, entirely like a video situation but you know they put pictures on their like updates which is really cool because i see everything and it's so cool she's actually happy i don't know why i was thinking that she wasn't going to be okay i don't know why i think every mom will feel the same way um but she's actually happy she's smiling i'm like oh without mommy i'm offended but also i'm happy I'm happy that you're fine. I'm happy that you're mingling with other kids because that's exactly what I want for her. So this is such a big milestone. She's in daycare. She's literally out in the world by herself. She is in the world. <laughs> she is out. <laughs> anyway, so I'm about to take advantage of that. Um, it's 2.45. I'm about to take advantage and just tidy up the house. I don't like the way the house is looking. It's not looking crazy, but you know. I'd prefer if it was cleaner. <laughs> it's just who I am. So I'm going to put it together really quickly. I also ordered some food for me and my husband. So, um, cause I'm tired. It's not even Friday. I usually order food on Fridays. Um, but I'm hungry and I'm tired and I'm about to clean and I'm kid free today. So why not treat myself to something nice? Okay. So yeah. But I just wanted to update you guys on the daycare situation because it's going well. She's doing well. She's happy, smiling with other kids. She hasn't cried one bit. I honestly thought she would be crying. I thought in like one hour time, the daycare lady would be calling me and saying, you know what, I can't do it. But no, she's had the whole day and she's fine. So I'm excited. Tomorrow's another day. So we'll do it again tomorrow to see how it goes. Um, but yeah, that's the update on daycare. Oh. Food is here. I'm so hungry. Let's, let's take a look at what we have. Then I'm gonna take my time and sit down and eat like people do hmm? when they don't have kids. So we ordered some um, burrito bowls, the vegan burrito bowls, so shrimp burrito bowls, but my husband doesn't eat shrimp, unfortunately, so he's eating meat, <laughs> unfortunately, but I ordered shrimp for myself. And we we're trying food from this Mexican place for the first time. I'm actually very excited. We usually, for whatever reason, we haven't tried them. I don't know why we never try them, because they're actually very close to us. But we've always done like Thai food, Chinese, pizza. Um, there's one place that I still want to try. It's Italian. It's right here, right next to Jack's. I want to try that. Um, but this, I'm excited because this is uh, Mexican. I love Mexican food. I love tacos. You know, I feel like they have very similar foods to us. So this is, I think this is my husband's. Yeah. So I'm not... I'm not gonna open that up because he is working. So, oh, I can't wait. It smells so good. It smells insane. Oh, what's this? Okay. Oh, this looks so good, right? Oh, this looks so good. Oh, every time. I'm sorry if you don't like that. I know people don't like sometimes people who smell food but i smell all my food i'm a very nasal type of person <laughs> but i know every time i've bought food with shrimp from like a, any joint the shrimp is like five if you can relate comment below because why would you buy food sometimes i order food from chinese and they say chinese lo mi and the shrimp is literally let me say chinese lo mi <laughs> shrimp lo mi and the shrimp is literally five five I'm like I could have done that <laughs> I ordered food because I didn't want to cook you give me five pieces of shrimp this is the most generous shrimp I have seen in my life it may be chopped into you know little it's not even so little it's like good pieces 
Oh, this is very, very good. I'm not even mad. <laughs> it makes sense. It makes sense, their price point. Um, because this entire pack for $16, you get rice, you get black beans, you get corn. It's literally a burrito bowl, you guys know. And the stuff can be expensive. So for what they're giving me, I am very impressed. And then they also added some churros. Just some... You know the funny thing? I was gonna order one of them. <laughs> oh, it's actually really nice. I'm sorry, what? Oh. Mm, did I do a plantain? Hmm. <laughs> what's this done with? This is really nice. It's like homemade taco chips really really nice very very nice um i i've lost my train of thoughts because the food is literally calling me but i'm gonna go eat i was in the process of cleaning the kitchen i'm going to eat um and i will see you guys later i want to make some queso dip <laughs> i literally saw it when i was trying to order the food from them it's called queso dip I think it's cheese dip and then you have it with the chips and lo and behold they gave me the chips it's two so I'm gonna make the queso dip later today with you guys should be nice um but yeah let's go and enjoy my lunch that is gonna be my lunch stroke it's three o'clock so that's gonna be my lunch yeah and then I'm just gonna watch some vlogs or maybe watch shouting but I'm happy I'm happy I have food and I'm gonna go enjoy uh, uh, uh. Mm -mm. <laughs> it's okay <laughs> yeah <-ho! laughs> someone is running around she's excited Hello. Hello. I miss you I miss you <laughs> what did you do today what did you do <laughs> yes what you had a good time in school? You had a good time? <laughs> Hi! <laughs> We're home guys. Daycare day one went so well. Look at her. She's happy. She's excited to be back home. You can tell from the way she's acting. She's very excited. So, Mommy won. Daycare one, mommy zero. I don't know. I don't know what people say, but yeah, daycare one. Okay. Good morning, my loves. Good morning. Happy Friday. Let me turn down my. Okay. Good morning. Happy Friday. Um, daycare drop off is done. I didn't really, I don't think I really spoke to you guys. Um, but yeah, I did daycare drop off. I came back home not so long ago. But yeah, it's Friday. It's day two. She was crying a little. I'm not gonna lie. She was crying just a little. But it wasn't like crazy. But also because she was crying. Even when I woke her up, she was still sleepy. And like, you know, I feel like she didn't sleep early yesterday. So we try to build a good routine because now we know the schedule and we know how it should go so going and she started at the end of the week so i'm not gonna be so hard on myself you know so next week we'll make sure that we have everything in check um you know with the timing just so that she's fine she can have enough sleep and everything but the good thing is that they care so they sleep anyway so she'll be fine um but yeah i'm looking forward to um updates in the app i'm not even gonna lie i'm really looking forward to some updates in the app so yeah uh but yeah i'm about to make some breakfast for my husband and i okay we're enjoying our kid free time i told you guys yesterday and today we've just been enjoying kid free days and you know i'm just 
it's nice or whatever but you kind of miss the little craziness around the running around and you know but yeah that's just life <laughs> that is just life anyway let me just quickly fix some coffee for myself so that we can get into doing the day i want to create some content um i'm not really working today i'm not gonna lie i'm not really working today so yeah because i took the day off <laughs> i took the day off so yeah i'm gonna be creating content i have some content that i have to deliver literally by the weekend literally by the weekend so i have to do that today and film bits and pieces of that content you know and then i have to edit i have to do stuff i'm not gonna lie i have to edit i have to do stuff social media work is calling <laughs> so that's today's dedicated to that and the way my life is becoming right now and the way i'm dedicating more time to social media <laughs> that's all i can say anyway i'm gonna make some breakfast myself and my husband and just go along with the day i hope you guys are having a good day so far and i just want to say that i am ready to take out my wig um i have enjoyed it so far this is actually really good can you imagine when i tell you i don't really like do much with the hair sometimes i don't even like you know like brush it out when i'm going to bed i'm just tired that i just put it up in a clip put my bonnet on and then i just go to bed you wake up and she's still fine and you know i wanted to wash it like actually get my hair wash while it's on my head but i'm also thinking it's a wig so i might as well take it off and then i also want to actually go and get my hair done so decisions um but either way you guys will see what happens to us i mean in the future <laughs> but yeah this is my favorite okay this stuff is so good add this to your coffee and it's game over i'm not even gonna lie this is just a drink so that's what we're gonna have with our breakfast breakfast for today for my husband and i i like my eggs a little runny or a little soft so yeah but we're just gonna go enjoy that and i will see you guys in a little bit so i hope that like me here is not so bad um but i have a few things from amazon that i want to unbox with you guys so Let's do that. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. So, it looks like I have some shoes. Okay. Let's see what shoes these are. So, I have some new shoes from Amazon. Um, these are sandals, actually. This is what it looks like. Um, it's very like simple strappy sandals but also you know it has this extra detailing in the front which I really really like and then the bottom is a little extra that's one thing about me it has to have something you know it has to have something that is given statement so I really like it it's from the brand called Moda Top from Amazon you guys know um, so this is just generally what it looks like. It's a just regular strappy heel. So you strap it around, make it look cute or whatever. But this is what it looks like. Very simple, very basic, but also very classic, you know. So I like that. And then item number two that I have is a wig. I know that it's a wig because I am excited for this particular wig. It's a honey blonde wig. And... This is the hair color that I, I think this is the hair color that I actually had my hair dyed in a while ago, but you know, it does get a lot of stares from a black person, but right now, a lot of girls are changing the narrative. People are wearing a lot more color when it comes to hair, so. Ah, look at the color. Oh, okay. Sorry. But you guys can actually tell what color this is. I'm not going to go so much into this hair because I will have a whole install video for you guys very soon. So definitely look forward to that. But I am very much excited for this hair. Like, oh, the colors and everything is just so gorgeous. Look at the color. This is really beautiful. So when I post the install video, be sure to watch it. 
okay be sure just let me just say that be sure to watch it because it's simple but then it will be good oh it's so cute it's already packaged oh my goodness okay so i got these these are candles but they're also they're not just candles they're party favors right and so if you're having like a party or whatever you can gift these to people and again you guys will see what this is for when the time gets there i'm not even gonna lie i can't talk about it right now um but when it get there you guys will see and i'm excited because oh i'm excited oh i'm excited for that okay so the next thing that i have the last thing and we will let me just bring it out okay so i am currently working with this brand right here called dramatica so i'm gonna go into this a lot more when i'm doing my nighttime routine we will talk about it but dramatica is literally a personalized brand um i mean like when it comes to skin let me gather my thoughts so we can actually talk about talk about this because dramatica is a skincare brand they do personalized skincare products for you so we'll talk about it okay we'll talk about it when i'm doing my nighttime routine but i'm gonna go check on my dinner i will show you guys what i make you know at the end of the day and yeah i'm excited so <laughs> yeah can we please have um gabe start by himself Since we was kids, you taught me how to fringe kiss. Now you so cold with your business, but you still don't know what love is. Love is more than feelings, it's choices. Why we so indecisive? All these years later, still the same shit. Running, open cycle, but before it closes, I want you to want me. So I just got out of the shower. My nails are done. I will show you properly when my hands are moisturized because it does look crazy. Um, but I, it's time for this product right here. So this portion of the vlog is sponsored by Dematica. Dematica, my skin is dry right now because we're about to put it on. Um, but Dematica is a subscription based skincare brand or skincare service where you have licensed dermatologist scanning your skin just basically taking a look at your skin and prescribing something that works for your skin's need so that's what we have here okay what you do with dermatica and it's just this little bottle right here the small bottle right here what you do is that you're gonna go on the website basically take some pictures of your face i took a picture of my whole face the sides and uh, i mean both sides of my face and then they basically scan your face they ask you some questions you know some concerns that you have about your skin and whatnot and then you have a licensed dermatologist prescribe something for you and then they make it just for you so this that i have right here it's customized for my skin and my skin alone and nobody else can use it and that's why I like um, you know the idea of Dermatica because I feel like something that is prescribed for just me I like that okay I'm not gonna lie when it comes to my skincare I don't really do crazy with my skincare because I'm grateful I have I have a good skin I can't even hide the fact that I have a good skin I don't break out like I barely get pimples the farthest my skin will go is some textures here and there but aside that my skin is has always been good and shout out to my mom and dad i'm very grateful for them because they have good skin enough to have like given me that 
but with that being said i also i'm still very particular about my skincare product um i know what my skin needs for itself let me just say that i know that my skin thrives on hydration you know i know the things that i should use for my skin and i've stuck to them so i don't really i would use like different brands of product but i would use the same type of product if it makes sense like i'll use different brands of hyaluronic acid but it will always be hyaluronic acid for me if it makes sense yeah so this came in about like a day or two ago i haven't touched it i haven't used it because i really wanted to you know use it with you guys and just show you what it looks like um, but again this is literally what you get with the bottle all you need is one or two pumps and you know put that in a few areas and you're good to go so this is legit just like going to the doctors and getting um, moisturizer pres prescribed for your skin you know and this is medical grade type of moisturizer so I'm happy about it in here for me I have trentinoy and then I have niacinamide and I'm actually you guys are very used to this at this point I'm actually very familiar with trentinoy and niacinamide because I've used products with these two you know actives in them before and um, my skin actually really like trentinoy i'm not even gonna lie i used it one time with one brand i can't really mention but my skin loved it <laughs> it loved it i just didn't like the brand so i'm like you know what i'm not coming back to you but i'm going to look for trentinoy again so i'm happy that i have it here and i'm excited to see i know that that makes my textures like so smooth so i am so happy about this um but again this is my prescription it has been signed literally like you see a pen ink on it you see that it's been signed you see my name it literally has my name here and like you know what they have inside and everything so this is really good i am working with dermatica so i'm gonna leave a code for you guys i do have a discount code with dermatica so i'll leave it for you guys in the description box as, as well as on the screen if you wanted to try them out and you know just basically build a routine for yourself the age that we're getting to right now 28 29 you definitely want to have a routine if you're pushing 30 sis <laughs> if you're pushing 30 and you don't have a routine then i don't know what you're doing if you're pushing 30 and you don't have a skincare routine i don't know what you're doing i really don't because you need to have a routine okay so that's all i can say um it does say that right after cleansing your skin you want to put it on but my skin is too dry from talking to you guys so i'll just quickly put some toner on my skin because it just doesn't feel right to put it on dry skin so let me tone my skin <laughs> they said one or two pumps so that's what i have and i'm definitely the type of person that likes a lot of moisturizer so this is like um mm, i'm happy that this is just like treatment for my face And then you want to go ahead and follow it up with your regular moisturizer. So I'm going to do that. Okay. <laughs> so my nails. Done. I have them red as usual. Like I don't know what you're expecting. But they're always going to be red. Or nude. Literally. Always. <laughs> always. Um. But that's it for the night. I'm gonna go to bed. It's Friday night, so I'm just gonna chill. Maybe watch a movie. Yeah, that's my call. I'm gonna go. And I will see you guys tomorrow morning, okay? Good morning. Happy Saturday. Um, why does my freaking thing look like that? Good morning, guys. Happy Saturday. I'm about to take down my hair. It's time for this wig to go. I have to install a new wig plus I'm also I'm also trying to go and get my hair done maybe next week I want to get a sewing done but professionally done just to see just to see what the vibe is okay so um, I'm gonna take this out so I can you know put on a wig for a hot minute before I don't know if I have a new wig that I really want to put it on so I mean that I really want to try so I'm gonna do that while um, I wait for my appointment to come up so yeah it's time for this hair to go 
uh, uh. Okay, stop. But my nails, though, I totally love it. Like, I feel like I do the same thing every time. So you guys are definitely used to seeing that same basic shit. You know, let me just take this out because, yeah, I'm ready for it to go. I did it. It's out. And again, I just want to say this hair is my favorite hair yet. Like this is the best hair that I have done so far. It's not a closure. I don't stress with glue. I don't stress with straightening my hair because my hair in the front is already straight. If you know, you know. <laughs> um, but this hair is just so comfortable. It, it's like it's the best hair that I've done so far, I'm not gonna lie. I just have to take it out because I have to wash my hair. Um, not really wash my hair, but also like, you know, get my hair ready for another hairstyle. I'm trying to take care of my hair in a way that when I do my hair, it has to at least last like three weeks or one month. So that's what I'm doing. Because I remember back home, growing up as a young girl in Ghana, that's what we would do. They would do your hair and then sometimes it will last the whole week, sometimes it will last for two weeks and then you go back to the salon again after two weeks, you know. So I want to go back into that African style routine of taking care of my hair or let me say Ghanaian style of taking care of my hair because it was good, it was healthy. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I will not be like doing my hair back and forth. When I install a wig, it's going to be that same wig for like a whole two weeks. So that's it, okay? I feel like that's the best thing to just leave my hair, not play with it so much, you know, just not do so much with my hair. So I feel like that will let me leave my hair to relax a lot more. So yeah, I took out the wig. I'm about to wash my hair. I'm not about to wash my hair with the cornrows out. I'll leave it like this literally and wash it because I can't do this color for myself. So I'll leave it like that. This is not like an actual wash. Veggie, veggie man. This is like a temporal wash. This is just a temporal wash because I deal with the worst dandruff in the world. <laughs> Let me just say that. I have very dry and flaky scalp. So sometimes it's like very dry and flaky <laughs> and I hate it. So that's why I want to wash it. So I'm just going to like quickly wash my hair. Nothing serious. Let it dry down and then I will install a wig right over this corner because I'm not taking it down. No. <laughs> so it is a lot less later. Literally like so much later. It's currently 8 p.m. I don't know what time you guys saw me. I think when you guys saw me I was making breakfast. Um, but guess who has a blonde hair on? <laughs> like, I'm trying to fix my ear ear because <laughs> guess who has a blonde hair on? Like, this is so exciting because I have never tried blonde hair in my life before. Ah, who is this girl? <laughs> like, okay. I feel like this is, I don't know how the girls do it. It's like, how do you girls do it? How do you wear, like, it's beautiful, it's gorgeous, don't get me wrong, but this, I feel like it takes a lot of courage. Like, how are you wearing this? It's, I don't know. For me, it's like, it's a lot. It's like, you want some water? I have an install video for you guys on my YouTube, I mean, on here, so obviously you guys will see what it looks like but you want some more water this is a 5x5 five five closure so it's not a frontal and that's the exciting part the video is not a frontal it's giving it's giving like she's covered the whole frontal whatever but it's really beautiful um, I just don't have the confidence to show up anyway a blonde hair I don't know I don't think I can ever do it I mean if I feel like if the color was just a brown shade you know and not this this blonde this blonde is too much for me but this honey blonde i could do you know like the area where it's not so blonde like the brown in this area i can definitely wear that but this one too much definitely too much for me <laughs> definitely too much for me but that's what it looks like um, and I just really wanted to you know install for you guys to see what it looks like by itself 
before I go ahead and dye this out because I certainly will dye it out as a 5x5 closure so I feel like this is going to be more like an everyday way for me because you know it's 5x5 five five, it's long it's my vibe <laughs> definitely my vibe the color is just not my vibe because I'm not I'm not this type of person okay like I don't know how to do it like oh it's too much for me like I'm like wow I don't know how you girls do it but I don't think I can. <laughs> I just don't think I can. I can't show up anywhere in like this much blonde hair. It's too much for me. Definitely too much for me. So I'm going to tone it down with some dye over the week. But for right now, we have it on. So yeah. <laughs> but I honestly just wanted to. I'm sorry. My little girl. She's having a time. Adia Sama. Adia Sama. She's having a time of her life because she's eating some jello fries. But I am just right here. I, I mean, I'm coming on here to end off the vlog. It's Saturday night. I do have to end off the vlog because I've realized that when I take it into Sunday, it doesn't really help because it just stresses me out and I have to edit it. And, you know, editing sometimes take a day or two. I, I don't want to be late. So I'm just going to end it off here. You guys already know what I do on Sundays. It's just content creation. I have a new wig installed. So for me, tomorrow i'm gonna just do my makeup and do some outfits as per usual just what i do every time um but thank you so much for watching this week's vlog this week has been a lot of like mom errands daycare errands and stuff like that i hope you liked it comment below if you have any questions whatsoever um if you want a link for this hair i will leave it for you below if i don't be sure to leave a comment so i can leave a link um but i also have an install video like i told you guys so you can always check that out um if you don't follow me on instagram please do i can share Benhini on instagram and tiktok the whole nine yards i love you guys and i will see you in the next week's vlog okay bye <laughs> when they say she get it from her mama Mama say you fuck her right Your body do this bumper like Tell me in the hall But come tell me is you down Cause I'm tryna go good tonight I hope you slept right I just wanna live in a fantasy I think we deserve